Homeowners in New Jersey recently bought a new house and were going to do some renovations to it. After rainstorms, some sections of their basement became flooded and waterlogged. They removed part of the wall and discovered almost 100 empty bottles of Captain Morgan in the wall. A large pile on the floor started when they were removed and more and more kept coming out. It seemed as though the previous owner of the house may have had a drinking habit. This proved to be true and the homeowner got into contact with the previous owner who said there were hundreds more bottles in the house and he is also now sober. In 2006, a contractor in Cleveland, Ohio was tearing the walls out of a home. After walls were removed, he found two green metal lock boxes behind them. When he opened up the boxes, there were envelopes full of cash. There turned out to be $182,000 of Depression era money. The money had been stashed there by wealthy businessman Patrick Dune. After the money was found, the contractor informed the homeowner. However, they had a disagreement on how much money they would each get. In the end, the contractor was finally awarded a few thousand dollars, and 21 descendants of Patrick Dune got small amounts as well. The rest, the homeowner kept. In Elbow Lake, Minnesota in 2013, another contractor was doing work on a house. This house was built in 1938, and the contractor removed some of the walls. Behind these walls, there were some newspapers used for insulation. There was also an old comic book found within the wall. It was a copy of Action Comics No. 1, also from 1938. This was the first ever comic with Superman in it, and extremely rare and valuable. The comic found in the house unfortunately had the back cover detached. Because of that, it was only graded at a 1.5 out of 10, and a mint copy is reportedly worth over $2 million. The comic found in the wall was still very valuable though, and sold for $175,000. This next discovery was worth even more than the last two put together. In 2006, a Norman Rockwell painting was discovered behind a fake wall in a Vermont home. The painting is called Breaking Home Ties and was reproduced for the cover of the Saturday Evening Post in 1954. The painting had already been on display in the house, but that one was later proved to be not an original. The original was hidden behind the walls. Donald Trachty, who had owned the house, is believed to have made the copy himself. He also drew the comic strip, Henry. His son said that he thought his father wanted to tuck the painting away for his kids. Donald Trachty Jr. was also the one who made the discovery. He noticed a gap in the wood paneling and pulled it out, revealing the original painting as well as others. We removed the bottom shelf. We could just wow. begin to pull the wall open like this. And there we are. Inside this secret wall, all eight of the family's paintings, including breaking home ties. Later that year, the painting ended up being sold for $15.4 million. In 2021, a woman living in New York City felt cold air somehow blowing in her bathroom. She couldn't figure out where it was coming from at first and did an investigation. She came to figure out where it was coming from and realized that it was coming from the sides of her mirror. After removing the mirror, she found out that there was a hole in the wall big enough to crawl through, and inside that hole was a room, which was part of a three-bedroom apartment. She ended up exploring the apartment, which was vacant, and appeared to possibly be under construction. Hartso recorded the discovery and what came next in four videos. There's a room back there. Cliffhangers punctuating her creepy find. I have to go in. I can't not know. I can't not know what's on the other side of my bathroom. This is a pretty crazy discovery for somebody living in New York City. Most people there have small apartments and would love more space. It's unclear what ended up being done with this space that was found. A Florida man and Florida woman living in a house in St. Petersburg made an interesting discovery. In 2021, they were doing a bathroom remodel and had to remove the shower. Years earlier, they had removed a bee's nest from the wall in that bathroom. The homeowners were aware that some bees still lived in the house and didn't mind it all that much. But when they did the remodel, they removed the wall to find a much bigger nest than expected. There were as many as 80,000 bees behind the wall and it took a beekeeper about five hours to remove it. There were so many bees that honey was everywhere. Lots of the honey was saved and the bees were also able to be relocated. 
in 2023, a Colorado woman moved into a new home in Centennial. As she was moving into the house, she noticed that her dog was looking at something. She investigated and saw two holes in the wall and snakes slithering into them. Later, snakes were found behind drywall and underneath the patio of the home. Some snakes were caught and removed from the house. They were said to be two to three years old and had been there for a long time. There were likely also more snakes inside. The snakes are believed to be large garter snakes. With snake traps and the help of a snake wrangler, 10 total snakes were removed from the house over the span of 10 days. In 2012, a Los Angeles area restaurant got a renovation. Behind one of the walls, a neon light was found that was on, and it turns out that the light had been on for 77 years straight. It was found behind a wall in the bottom floor women's bathroom. The light was likely installed in 1935 when the building was a forest-themed restaurant. It's unbelievable how the light was able to stay on for so long, but it did. It was also estimated that the light was responsible for about $17,000 in electricity bills over the years. In 2023, homeowners in Sonoma County, California called pest control when they saw worms coming out of a bedroom wall. After professionals came out to the house, they saw that the worms were mealworms. They made a four inch hole into the wall and acorns began spilling out. The acorns were where the worms had come from, but the acorns just kept pouring out from the walls. There were at least 700 pounds of acorns that were stored in the walls. They got there by woodpeckers. It is said that the woodpeckers collected the acorns and likely dropped them down the chimney. They also entered the attic through a separate hole. The pest control experts said that it's one of the strangest things they had ever seen. Workers say the woodpecker was making holes to store its food and the food kept falling into spaces in the walls. Then when they cut into the wall, 700 pounds of acorns came flowing out. In 2023, a homeowner in the UK found that her shower was leaking. There was a gap in the tiles which was causing the leak. The house was old and the previous owners had tiled directly onto wooden panels. However, when they were removed, a whole other shower was found behind it. Behind that was another layer of tiles and a mirror. That's all for today's video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.